Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. Today I have a special guest. I have my fiance here. So if you've seen Vlogmas 2018 or 2019, then you would have already met Gil. But I figured we would do a sit down together video. Um, we're a little awkward. This is our first time filming a sit down video together, obviously. So bear with us. But we have some questions that we're going to be answering. So if you've seen Vlogmas 2018 or 2019, then you've already seen Gil. I asked on Instagram if you guys had any questions for a Q&A, and some of you did have some, which I really appreciate. Um, so I'm pulling them up right now, but this is probably going to be a short video because I didn't get that many questions. So Julie, one of my favorite friends um, and co-workers, asked who cooks the most or who cooks better. So you answer that first because I already know what your answer is going to be. Well, um, I actually do enjoy uh, cooking breakfast. I am a breakfast person. There will be times where like 7 o'clock at night and I'm dying to go to IHOP. So I definitely enjoy breakfast the most out of all my meals. So I would say I cook the most as far as breakfast. But I think you also cook a lot of meat. Like you can cook the meat. I, I have a thing about touching raw meat. I like cooking steak a lot. So um, you do, you've done burgers. I, I, I do rice pretty well as well. Um, I could do like potatoes and all that stuff as well. I actually enjoy cooking just breakfast. That's So Anika, one of my other friends, asked, uh, will you guys be staying in New York City after the wedding? So we were originally going to do a wedding series or a wedding planning video, but because of this virus, things have gone on to be even more delayed than they already were. So um, will we be staying in New York City? Yes. Right? Yeah, for now. Because of our job, um, if we didn't, ha if we commuted to work in a car, then I feel like we would be able to have more options. But right now, that's like my top priority is just being able to get to work at a reasonable amount of time with a reasonable amount of commuting. Um, but I feel like if we did have a car, I wouldn't mind moving like a little bit more upstate or like Westchester, you know, places like that where we can have a little bit more space. But no, we're probably going to stay in New York City. We're probably moving boroughs, though. So we'll be moving out of his apartment. Hopefully, if we save up right, spend our money well, uh, we'll be moving out of your borough into where we're I We're to Queens or Brooklyn. That's our two options at the moment. Our next question is, what are your... This is more for me. Uh, what are your go-to hairstyles for date night? So, prop, well, I mean, I feel like you can answer that. What's my go-to hairstyle for date night? Straight hair. For sure. <laughs> Straight hair, for sure. Straight hair, yeah, I have straight hair right now. Um, Even though she does look beautiful in curly hair, but she just won't admit that. She doesn't feel as confident in curly hair, but I think she looks great in it. Thank you. Yeah, I don't, um, straight hair is my go-to. Um, I don't really do anything in terms of updos or anything because I'm very tender-headed. So when I was younger, my mom would put me in, like, hair ponytail, like ponytails uh, to go to school, and I would get massive headaches. So I don't even put my hair up. My hair is always down. It's either straight or it's curly. I think the most I ever do to it is put like maybe a headband on, but that's about it. So straight hair is my go-to for date night. Very simple. The next question isn't, um, the next question isn't my neighbors. The next question is not a uh, product really. Uh, the next question is not about, um, couples, but I'm going to answer it anyway. It's um, not couple related, but what products do you use to enhance your curls? Because I do have a video coming up where I talk about my curly hair product collection. Any gels, any mousses, I tend to get the most hold from. So anything from Miss Jessie's, anything from Shea Moisture's, Coconut and Hibiscus line are things that give me the most hold uh, without being super crunchy. I don't really mind crunchy curls, honestly, if they look good from afar, but whatever. Anyway, um, so that's it for our questions for now. I did this poll last night, so I don't know if there's any point in waiting to see if any do more will come up. Do you want to do a random question? 